hello guys this is Siva here again welcome back to my channel in today's video i'll be sharing with you guys a very special boom and crash strategy that you can use to grow your small account okay this strategy is a very good strategy it's very good profitable and simple to understand okay so in this video i'm going to be showing you guys how to use this wonderful strategy to grow your small account okay be it a ten dollar twenty or thirty dollar right whichever account size you are using with this strategy you are going to be profitable okay and i'm going to be showing you the techniques and the conditions you need to take trades with this strategy okay so if you want to see me do that make sure you stick to this video don't go anywhere guys don't skip any part of this video watch the video till the very end okay so with that being said let me share with you how the strategy work okay before i do that i'm going to first of all share the indicator settings with you guys and the first thing you have to do is to click on this n icon here so after clicking on that our first indicator here is the moving average all right so you are going to search for the moving average by clicking on this icon and then you search for the moving average right now the period for this one is 30 the shift is zero the method is exponential take note of that apply to is close under the star we have three mm, sorry two pixel the color is red right and after that you click on save you are done with that the next indicator here is going to be the um factor but it's not needed okay it's not needed for this strategy maybe in the next strategy to put it in my chart okay it helps for some reasons but it's not of any use in this particular strategy all right so the next indicator here is going to be the awesome oscillator all right so before you add the awesome oscillator you have to click on this icon right so you add you search and add the awesome oscillator right now this is the default setting for the awesome oscillator you don't need to change anything okay just click on the default setting and you click on save right after adding the awesome oscillator you are going to have the indicator window one being formed all right so before you add the relative strength in there you are going to click on this icon and f icon here and then you search for the relative strength index now these are the parameter for this one the period is 14 the apply to is close under this side we have to pick side you make the color the color of your background okay if you are using a black background you use black you're using a white just like mine so you use white okay now for the levels you are going to be setting it to 18 and 15 all right so let me delete this and do it again if you want to add your level you click on this icon here and then you, you add it twice right you change this to 85 and you make this 15 you make this two pixel and you choose the color black right Choose color black you go back and you click on save you're going to have the screen like this if you do everything correctly okay so now that we are done with the setup let me explain how to scalp with this particular strategy okay in this in this video in today's video I will be explaining how to scalp with this strategy and then in the next video I'm going to be explaining how to use this same strategy to to uh, catch spike okay you can use this strategy to scalp and same time use it to catch spike okay that's why i see it's a very special strategy now the first condition before you take any entry with this strategy is that you see this red and green line here they must be touching the 15 level or oh, sorry the 85 level once you see that they have then there was a spike and this line here is now touching the 80 level all right so maybe once that spike happen it's going to be green all right first of all you are going to observe that it has started changing to red all right now once you see that it has touched the 85 level and it has started changing to red you are going to be observing here on the main chart all right that's, this is your first condition being met and the second condition is that you you'll be watching the main chart patiently you are going to be watching the candlestick coming down coming down so once it cross below this uh, red moving average all right the 30 moving average here once it close below it 
now that is your second confirmation guys that is your second confirmation Don't, it doesn't mean that you should take entry it right that is to tell you that yes price is really changing the trend is really changing now okay now this is where you'll be taking your entry immediately you see the crossing here immediately that you see that this thing cross below the zero level that is where you take your entry and you are going for five candles only you take five candles and you are done with this so once you see this crossing happen here on the main chart you wait for the crossing to happen on the indicator window and then you take your five candles you exit the market okay you don't need to stay long that's why it's a scalping all right that's why it's a scalping strategy you wait again you can see there was a spike it's now touching you wait for this crossing and this one you take your five candles let's go again now you see another example here again you see this you wait for the crossing on the main chart and then on the indicator window crossing below the zero level here and then you go in for your five candles all right that five candle is going to be yours before any spike happen all right if you follow the condition as i've explained okay if you follow the condition now you see here this is why you are not to take entry once it crossed the red line you see it crossed but there was this spike but here if you observe there was no there was no crossing so it's not sealed right now you wait again now once the crossing happened here and it happened here also once the two are in agreement you go in for your five candles the five candles is going to be yours all right but if you don't wait maybe it crossed below the red and you just go in there might be spike and sometimes there might be no spike right but to be safe make sure you wait for maybe sometime the indicator is going to cross first and the um on the main chart is not the, the the candlestick will not yet cross the red line all right but you are going to make sure the boots are in agreement like if it cross first on the main chart here you are going to wait for the indicator to also cross before you take any candle and if it cross first on the indicator window here you are going to also wait for it to cross on the main chart before you take any entry okay that's the condition for this strategy before you take any entry okay so make sure you take note of that guys take note of that and with this strategy you don't need to go to the higher time frame to do your analysis okay not in this uh, case all right you don't need to go to the higher time frame just follow the condition i've given here and you are good to go all right but if you decide to go to the higher time frame and do your analysis it's going to work very well if you are in a downtrend okay this is boom 1000 so if you are trading against the trend then we are going to be following the downtrend all right we are going to be following the trend which is going to be a downtrend right now that is all for this all right so make sure you backtest this strategy guys make sure you backtest it very well and see how it work for yourself okay don't just take my words for it once you rest uh, once you follow the condition i've given and stay disciplined to it you are going to be making money over time with this strategy all right it's a very powerful strategy guys and in my next video i'll be showing you guys how to also catch spike with this same strategy all right so that is pretty much everything for the zoom level this is the zoom level i always use in all my strategies okay zoom out completely and you zoom in one two all right this is the zoom level okay for those of you that will still want to ask right so that is pretty much everything if you haven't yet subscribed please make sure you do that give the video a thumbs up if you know you are getting value from it and also share with your friends and family so that they can also use it to make money all right so with that being said, I'll be seeing you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching. Silver out.